station has a grade point average of 5.194. By virtue of his high academic standing and achievement in extracurricular activities, he was chosen to become a member of the National Honor Society and the Spanish National Honor Society. Our salutatorian is multifaceted. He has a deep love of music, as an accomplished cellist with perfect pitch, as well as a baritone cantor, and serves as the president of our Mass Ensemble Club. In addition to being an active member in the Honor Societies and Mass Ensemble, he was also the co-president of the Literary Club and a member of the Carl Newman Band, Key Club, Honor Council, and Philosophy Club. In addition to all of that, this year he was also a staff member of the Carl Newman newspaper. And he has spent numerous hours volunteering, 763.8 to be exact. Using his musical talents, he has volunteered at many masses, both at Carl Newman and numerous churches in our diocese and beyond, as a cantor, solo cellist, usher, and altar server. Additionally, he has found time to volunteer for Cross Catholic Outreach, Gold Coast Syndrome Association, as well as participating in the St. Jude's Children Hospital Fundraising Walks. Our salutatorian is the recipient of the Carl Newman Medal of Excellence in both community service and English, and is the Carl Newman High School Pathfinder nominee in science. Next year, this young man will be attending Ave Maria University. There, he plans to major in nursing. Ladies and gentlemen, it is an honor to introduce our 2024 salutatorian, Mr. Nathaniel Gonzalez. Books. 
Plus the amazing stories I'll get to tell my roommates from other states to make them think Honors English 1 is the Floridian experience. Uh. <laughs> Dr. Sinha, thank you for bringing out the best of us in our small AD chem class and for Sweet Caroline, Car uh, Sweet Caroline Karaoke Afternoons in the labs. Mrs. Smith, thank you for making math a subject I've never been particularly confident in. Uh, a relaxing and song-filled adventure. Mrs. Mrs. Mormon, for taking us around the world and opening our eyes to systems both good and bad. Mrs. Pollitz, thank you for the huge success in making the most of a year in a portable, full of great classes and labs. Dr. Nixon, for the creative opportunity to reenact Beowulf. Mr. Richard, for your clever, fast wit and efficiency. Mr. Bayardell, for your flexibility and dedication to faith, fun, and education. Thank you to Mr. Clark, Mr. Curtin, Mrs. Heidelbauer, Dr. Saber, and all the Newman staff behind the scenes. I would also like to especially thank Ms. Renner, my course teacher, for training me vocally for the last four years. Though I won't be singing professionally in my career path, I believe this special skill enhances both my faith and simply makes life more interesting to the special people in my life. Thank you, Dr. Novak, for your enormous influence in sparking my interest in philosophy. Your classes were arguably my favorites in all my years in Cardinal Newman. On top of that, thank you for supporting the Literary Club. I'll be glad to take both the newfound curiosity of life and spirit of creativity with a sprinkle of writer's block into my future life. To my friends and all the wonderful people I got to know here, Alexis, Janelle, Chris, Sarah, Nahili, Andy, and Lena, my senior squad. Thank you for being the chaotic duck gallery I know and love. Cyan, Julia, Michael, Miguel, Dean, and Lily, shout out to you for being some of the most vibrant, interesting people that I got that I wish I got to know sooner. To Dalen, Leah, Danny, Natalie, Kat, Bear, Gianna, James, Gabby, and the rest of 2024, congratulations. And to Kenzie, Falcone, Max, Alex, and Noah, my St. Clair class of 2020. Thank you for the memories. We made it. All right, there's just one last thing I want to do here. I would like to end this speech with the one friend who deserves the most credit. So, if we would all bow our heads and offer this prayer. Lord God, thank you for life, for freedom, for the future, for encouraging us all to get this far, for creating us, sustaining us, and for continually drawing us nearer to you. Let us now go out into this gift of a world you have given and glorify your name, Jesus, forevermore. Amen.